hello family welcome back to another hair tutorial in today's video we're going to be transforming this hair from this style to this perfect beauty if this look like what you are interested in definitely keep watching don't forget to like and share we love you just the way you love us thank you um, I just finished taking down the hairstyle. Can you guys still see the way my hand is gliding through? This is Kayla's hair after the one week of that treatment that I showed you guys. You guys will not believe it. Look at that. After one week, her hair is still this soft. Look at it. Look. Look. Oh my word. I gotta do that treatment 100%. I'll put the treatment in the description box of this video so you can check it out for yourself like this using this as my base go all the way like this like this keep going make a straight line just like this like this go all the way so now that we have done this part so you go from here you go all the way straight down like this then you go all the way again you come to the back again Go all the way. Boom. 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 So did you guys see that? So yeah. now we are done with a simple pattern. All we did was just cut it from here. Use our uh, ear as the guide. Go all the way straight down. Same thing here. Go all the way straight down. Just, just two. Boom, boom. So he gave us one, two, three, four. So now what I'm going to be doing is comb it then. I'll go ahead, smooth it out with my shine and jam. Then we use the baby wool. I'll show you guys how I'll do it. It's a very simple style. So this is baby wool. This is the wool I'm going to be using. So I have one here right on the floor. So what I'm going to be doing with that, I'm going to be cutting it. So this is what we have done. So I'm going to show you guys how I achieved this too. You know I parted them like this and I kept this aside. Now, we're going to be working with this. All you need to do is get a brush like this. Brushing all the baby edges, like so. So, Kela uh, gave herself a haircut from here. She took scissors and she cut a chunk of her hair out by herself. But, thank God for all the DIY, so the thing is growing back. So now, just brush them in, like so. Now that we're done brushing it in, I'm just going to go ahead and use this TGIN Rose Water Coils Refresher. So, just like that. Since the hair is dry, you don't want to leave it dry. So, you're just going to refresh it like that. Spray, spraying the edges. Now, it's a bit wet, not drippy wet. Not the way I want it. Just rub it in like that. So, now that we have rubbed that in, you don't want a situation whereby the hair will not be free. Just go ahead, use your uh, wide mouth comb and comb it through to be sure everything is fully detangled. So just comb it through like that. Now that I'm done combing it, you can see everything is all detangled. Then what I'm going to do is get this my mixture. This is my homemade uh, combo. <laughs> so. Just go ahead like that, rub it in your hand for shine. Just damp, damp. I'm not gonna put too much like that. Then smooth it in like so. Now that I'm done smoothing it in, I'm just gonna also uh, apply it to the edges. You want to make sure anytime you want to make a hairstyle that your your hair is well protected with moisturizer. It's well moisturized. If not. When you are taking down the hair, it's going to be so dry that will lead to lots of hair damage. So now we're going to smoothen everything out with uh, shine and jam. Just take a little like so, not too much. Then just rub it in. Use it to smooth all the edges in. Brush it in like that. I don't want to weave our edges. So now get a brush like this. Whatever brush you have could be tooth a uh, toothbrush. That you're no longer using any brush of choice smooth it in the way you see me do it then rub it in again see did you see that smoothness it's all lying down and this is not a retouch hair this is all natural so now that it's looking like this i'm going to turn her now 
and do the back side. So you go to, if you want the hair to go back, you pack it backward. But I don't want it to go back. I want it at the front. So I'll turn her back to the front. Then bring the hair a bit closer to the front, the way you want it. Like that. Now that it's looking like that, this is where our baby wool comes in. I showed you guys how I cut it just now. So like this. Place it like this on the hair. And begin to... I don't want to use rubber. Because the wool is way safer than rubber. Keep going. Go. See, I took this one out so I can use it tight when I'm ready. Just basically turning it around. Then you tie it. That is our number one tie. While you're on it, make sure it's not too tight. Just go. For the sake of when you're losing it, you want to be able to spot the wool with ease. That's why we are using or if not, three rounding is just okay. So I'm not rounding it tight. So now that we're done with that, just go ahead. Loop, loop, and tie. Like that. And I always ask my child, does it feel tight or is it just perfect like that? It's perfect. Yeah, that says perfect, it's not tight. Get the rope, get the scissors, cut it out. And the chain. In there. Cut it out. What I normally do is just separate it like this into two. Make sure no one is bigger. Now that it's well separated, you're gonna go ahead and separate this one too. Because if you want yours to be five, just go ahead and separate it the way you like. But well, I want it to be just four. So separate this one into two like that. Then you separate the other one into two. Now that we are done separating it, we we'll get our shine and jam. As I keep doing it, at interval, I will add a little for smoothness. So just rub it all the way down, like that. The hair is already detangled. Just give it a little bit of comb. I'm, I'm only saying she should hold the hair because I want her to stop sleeping. Obviously, it's not working. So I'm just going to clip them out by myself like that. And add it like that. Then, is it a cold one that you want or a hot one? I like a cold one. You like a cold one? Right? I'll go get you one then. Ha! Huh, anything to keep her eye open. So, just like that, this is the way I apply the shine and jam. Just twist it the way you like. See the way I'm doing it. Just kind of like round it like this. Then place it round. Place round. Then place twist. Twist it before you place it twist. Twist, add shine and jam for smoothness, then twist, twist, I'll show you a second time, then when you get to the tip, make sure you, when you're dividing it, divide it into two equal half, then smooth it out like this, boom, 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 finger cord, finger cord, like that, you have sealed it, look at that gorgeousness, so beautiful, this is all her hair. Just her hair, there's no wool or anything included. <laughs> so I decided to give her, she's smiling now. So I had to give her ginger to get rid of that uh, annoying sleep from her because she's sleepy. When you are feeling sleepy and somebody is disturbing you, it makes you feel like you want to slap somebody. If you're small, two years old, go slap me. <laughs> so <laughs> I gave her ginger. Now she's all smiling. So now, you guys saw what we did uh, We did before. Separate it again. Like that. Then go ahead. 
twist it. Like this. Some people twist like this. Go like this. You twisting it like this. And then you'll be adding it like this. But me, I just go with the two hand like this. Twist this one out. Then look, this is what I'm literally doing. Switch them. This is the last one from this part. After this example, I'm just gonna go ahead and do the other one off camera. If you are watching this Esther, have you joined the family? If yes, thank you so much. God bless you. I love you all. But if you have not joined, please consider joining. It's all of the natural here. Why not? This might be like sweet mouth. Say, mm. sweet mouth. See the way we're doing it. Twist, twist, twist. I'm not even going to have to comb, comb this one. Anyway, there's nothing to comb. It's already detangled. So just. <laughs> Smooth it in. Smooth it in. Smooth it in. This is my favorite kiss hairstyle of all time. I remember doing this hairstyle for Janelle like almost all the time. <laughs> my first child. <laughs> I love it. Instead of the hustle of doing a braid and the child will be crying. You know, braid at times, so it can be painful. But this one, always with ease. So it's not painful and it's style for all occasion and it fits every child. Whether black, green, yellow, Popo <laughs> is a hairstyle for all babies to rock. Look at that. Look at that. So now that we have done this side, one, two, three. So we're going to move to this other side. Okay, look at that. Oh my word, we are done with the hair. Now it's time for us to place accessories. <laughs> look at your fine teeth. I've just gone ahead to put this pink here for her because she loves the little pink there. I love then, pink so much. Yeah, I know. You love pink. It's, and it's like your favorite pink. color. So I'm going to go ahead and place this white here. Just like this. You see, mom, do my hair. It doesn't need to be tight at all. Look at that. Not just like that. My hair. It's not tight? Yes. You love it, right? Yes. So I'm just going to go ahead and, put the and place the red at the back. We got the bead, cut open like that. Then, here is your drink again. There's a beader that comes with the bead. So you can go ahead and bead it however you want it. Look, to place it in the in the stick that comes with it, all you need to do is grab one. Grab then you one. hold this place like this. Then you place Danger. it. <laughs> then you push it down. See, like that. So I'll just show one or two examples, so like that, put the bead, walk it past, and put the bead, let it go. So we have two, four, six, seven, we have seven here, and the strand of hair like this, pass it through in between the white space, like that. Where is the white space? Then go ahead, drag it all the way, that is seven on the hair. Like that. I'm going to add three more to make it ten. I'm mm -hmm. making my hair. You see that so, I said that he's making a bead. Like this. My bead is my favorite. Right. Boom! Then place it. bead is my favorite. Guys, you know mom's always bead when the children like bead. Yeah, so all mom, all mom should always put bead in their children's hair if uh -huh. your children like beads. The advisor, the advisor children likes beads every day. Oh, okay. So, this uh, accessory this one is a dollar ninety nine, the other one is the same. So, that's just basically two dollars. Right, so, I'll just get this one M. These are just letters. Take it around, take it around. Let's say like three or four. Around it, then when you're done, you close it. Look, you just basically press it in. Boom, like that. 
That's like all security. All these students like these. So now, boom, these that's it. Always, mommy always use. Mommy always use my hair. You got this one. Make my hair so now it's secure and beautiful. Okay, family. This is the finished look of the hairstyle. Look at her. Oh my god, she's so gorgeous. You can see all the accessories. I'm going to go ahead and add silver since I already have gold there. So just in case you don't know how to use this, spread the mouth. Don't uh, pay attention to my nails because of all the gels that I use so they are not inside my nails. Just get one silver like that, open the mount and place it. Thank you so much for watching this video. I love and appreciate you all. Like and share is a simple and beautiful hairstyle for all kids. All kids love it. Even Kayla love it. So, on that note, we say peace. peace. We. We.